So I remember going to the beach with my family when I was little. It was great. Sometimes I'd see a jellyfish washed ashore. There'd be all sorts of shells on the sand, which I immediately picked up, saved, and may still have somewhere. But when I was a kid, the one thing that I didn't see on the beach, which is everywhere now, is plastic. Luckily, there are innovators who are creating bots with a job of making beach sand far more bland. The good kind of bland. Meet Beebot, an eco-friendly beach cleaning robot that sifts sand to remove toxic plastics and trash without harming the environment. Kind of like a remote controlled Roomba for the beach. I connected with innovator Claire Touvier in Port France to hear more about this beach tidying technology. Hello, Claire, and welcome to Innovation Nation. Hi, Mo. Nice to be with you today. What was the inspiration for the BeachBot? What we set ourselves to do with BeachBot was to create a technology that would be able to clean the beach while having zero negative impact on the environment. Many beaches are cleaned by heavy-duty tractors or manual sifters that rake the sand, triggering beach erosion, crushing flora and fauna, and leaving small bits of plastic waste behind. Claire says the BeeBot cleans and restores the coastline without a trace. Let's talk technology. How does it work? It is able to pick up the trash while not digging deeper than 10 centimeters so that it does not damage the fauna and flora that lives in the sand or that also is there to protect the beach against erosions. The BeeBot is remote controlled and runs on battery and solar power. It can clean about 3,200 square feet in an hour roughly equal to the size of seven basketball courts. What kind of trash can it collect? Any trash starting from one centimeter. You cannot imagine how much cigarette butts, plastic wraps, straws you will pick up. Those degraded bits of plastic and trash that stay hidden in the sand wreak havoc once they make their way into the ocean. There are billions of plastic bits that are released into our oceans on a daily basis, and that impacts marine wildlife down to us if you look at the entire chain. Wherever there's sand on hand, this machine will keep beaches clean. Thank you for talking trash with us, Claire. Well, thank you so much, Mo, for having me today. It was a pleasure.